As we enter this era where voice becomes the dominant interaction model with AI, what does that mean for Cartesia? Voice is a fundamental modality. A lot of folks come to us and they ask us for really high naturalness in these models. How do I get the model to interact like a human would? And part of that is for use cases like support. For businesses, this is a game changer. You're gonna see a ton of deployments of voice agents across front desk, customer support, you know, back office. There's so many areas um, and industry sectors, you know, uh, financial services, healthcare, et cetera, where you're gonna see this actually emerge. And so one of the things we've also been doing is working with a, a set of businesses to understand how can we add more value on top of these models on the infrastructure side too. We started Cartesia because we really believe that we're just getting started in AI. There's a lot of problems to solve in making machine learning models more efficient. And multimodal data and multimodal applications are kind of the next frontier. Cartesia is really like a mix of a research lab and a product company. Sonic 2 is really us pushing the boundaries of the model's quality while maintaining latency. It's a voice generation engine. You can use it to create a highly expressive voice audio. You can do speed synthesis. You can voice clone. It's really a great tool for both use cases in the uh, voice calling side. So think customer support, you know, having an empathetic support agent you can talk to, uh, and the creation side where you just want to create cool content. So it really works well across those sets of use cases. And we've made sure that it's the fastest model in the world. And I would say deeply in integrated engineering driven culture.